lose yardage, but you find a way to go out of bounds and stop the clock. On third down, Vic. It's caught, Jones. And he'll get this one down near the 20-yard line, just shy of the 20. And a nice gain of 21 yards. Big hook up there, forced to throw it on third down. The connection's going to keep the drive alive and also keep the clock moving. Yeah, and from a defensive perspective, didn't get a sack, didn't knock the ball free, didn't break up the pass. The clock keeps running on you. You're in a dire situation now. And not totally home free yet, but it's looking good as they come up first and 10. On first down, it's Gurley. Oh, and now he bowls him over. And he'll be out of bounds, taking it just shy of the 10 at the 11 or the 12. Nine yards is the pick up there, and they'll have a second and one. Now, the objective there, I mean, yes, the positive gain, that's nice, but work some clock. Yeah, you're exactly right, but the problem for them is still within a possession, so they can't just sit on it running the ball. They'll have to find a way to throw it effectively as well. The six yards on the pickup, and it leaves him with a first and goal. Time for a break. We're back to see what happens after this. So it's Falcon football as we welcome you back. They've got it first and goal as they search for what could be a game ceiling touchdown. Working out of the gun, Michael Vick. Oh, incomplete. A turnover would have really helped there. Almost intercepted. Instead, it's just second down. And that's one he's got to be happy to have back. There wasn't a hole open in the zone. You'd have to think on early downs like that first down there. Need to be a little bit more careful. Yeah, fortunately for him, got a couple more downs to play with. Escaping the pressure right. And he'll be brought down this time at the five-yard line. Whistles now in a timeout. So defensively, they burn it here with 151 left. This has been a long drive. You got to figure a field goal would be a letdown. Can they convert now on third and goal? to throw, Vic. And that is incomplete. Certainly looked like they were getting ready to convert there on third down, but what an effort to get his hand on that one, knock it away, and brings up a fourth down decision. And Gold is able to put it through, and the drive will wind up yielding three. So they get the three, but you wonder now, is that gonna be enough? Excellent question, because when I look at the smiles on that side of the field, they're a little tight, aren't they? If they had scored a touchdown there, those would be big half-moon grins right now because they'd feel a whole lot better about their position. Uh, and a touchdown in the other direction, all of a sudden, they're down. The Chargers offense now, they get set to head back on the field. Let's go! He'll look to throw. Well, this complete to Henry over the middle. 15 yards is the pick up there and the drive starting very nicely. First down. First down now, but that clock rolling. He's hot. He's hot. They'll look to throw. This is Gordon on the dump off. No gain and it's second down. Well, he caught it right at the line of scrimmage and before he could even think about advancing it forward, he got hit. Great tackling because that's what you're taught. Don't give up yards after the catch. And most offenses make a living off of yards after catch. Those hidden yards that may not go into the score sheet, but they count big for moving the ball and stretching the field. Really nice open field tackle. One thing I think that's safe to say defensively, the tackling's been really good. And because of that, it's been very, very hard for them to move the ball because you're not getting the benefits of run after catch. The tackler almost on the spot. That means they have to run extra plays. Harder to move. Gets it to Gordon. And he'll be taken down across the 50 at the 45 in enemy territory. The Chargers passing game rolling a bit here. They've got another first. Back to throw. And he can't get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. Now the Chargers hustling, trying to get up and get set. He's back to throw. To the sideline. Wow, what a catch. Doesn't get a lot out of it. But he is able to keep the feet in bounds. Four yards on the completion, and it sets up a third down. 
Let's make this one simple. What a catch, especially the finishing part of getting his feet in bounds, toe tapping, and of course, he's got it with the 15. And all the way inside the 15 before they drop it. That goes as a gain of 37 on third down. Now the Falcons going to use one of their timeouts. It's just their first. They've got two more to use here in the final stages. Chargers will use the second of their timeouts as the clock will stop with 18 seconds Good. remaining. Here's Rivers. And this is caught. Touchdown. And now they're an extra point away from winning this thing in the final seconds. Well, that's the one they had to have. Put them in a position where they're tied up, but I got to get out of the way. We still got an extra point that's pretty crucial. That's right. Just one more element to complete the victory. It took them an extra look, but they found out it is a touchdown indeed. The official says this one counts. Sturgis for the extra point, and that might be enough to win them the football game as they now take the lead in the final seconds. This will be taken in at the one. And he'll get across the 20 before he's brought down at about the 23-yard line. Vic. He's going to let it fly. And oh, an acrobatic catch there by Watkins. Touchdown, Falcons. Sammy Watkins finding the end zone on the game's final play.